sticker. Hey, hey, everybody! This is the makeup tutorial portion of the trailer I did for the Jack of the Dust inspired crystallizing skull. All you gotta do. You're in the shop. <laughs> so let's just jump right into it. I'm making things easier for myself by outlining everything I don't want painted white. I'm using an old eyebrow pencil that doesn't match my hair color anymore. Whatever works. Right here, I am outlining my eye sockets, and this is really easy for doing skeleton makeup because you have an actual skull underneath all that skin. Spooky. So all you have to do is just feel where your bones are and just draw on them. Whoopsie. It's all right, accidents happen. It's just makeup, it washes off. As a base, I'm using foundation so that the paint has something to stick to. Using a white water activated paint on a damp beauty sponge, I'm just going to sponge this in and blend it out, just kind of focusing it wherever I used my outline. The next step is priming your eyes. Using a taupe colored eyeshadow, I exaggerated my crease. With a dark brown matte shadow, I did a halo eye. For the center of the halo, I used a shimmery brown color. Lighter than the outside of my halo, but darker than my crease. Add some mascara. Then I'm taking a bronzer and I'm just going to deepen up the areas that I want to look sunken in. This means I'm going to put it everywhere the lines are. Acting like the skull is sitting on top of my face and also acting like it's real. The next part is the teeth. This is really easy, but you also have to go really gentle with it because you could mess it up pretty easily. You're basically going to do a teardrop shape. For this look, I am blending the top of the tooth into the skull so it kind of mixes in with it, so it's not such a drastic change of skeleton to teeth. I only did the top half. I didn't actually do the mandible because I wanted it to be an elegant look. Feel free to copy the same thing on the bottom if you want more teeth. Don't forget to shade in between the teeth so you can see that they are individual teeth and not just one line. Line your lips. Add a dark lip color. Now here's the hard part. I am taking rock candy. This is grape flavored. It's definitely not meth. Don't worry about that. But you're basically going to find a placement and you're going to use spirit gum to stick them onto your head. I didn't show gluing it on right here because I had a two hour drive to the salt flats. The only problem is spirit gum dissolves sugar and I didn't know this until we got there. They ended up falling off the entire video because we didn't realize it would dissolve the candy. But hey, you live and you learn, and I think it worked out pretty cool. The rest of my skeleton body was actually painted on location, but they are the exact same steps as my face. Ta-ta-da, you're all done. Don't forget to check out the trailer for this video. It's like some sort of fancy music video. Have a happy Halloween. Oh!